What's going on, ballers? Welcome back to another Big J Basketball box break video. Today is Friday, so you know what that means. Flashback Friday, we're doing some Stadium Club Basketball 92-93 Series 2, looking for Shaq rookies and Beam Team inserts. So I opened a box this a few months ago. We'll probably do the same thing. We'll open half the box. There's, there's 36 packs, and some of the cards might be uh, stuck together a little bit, so might take some time. So we'll do 18 packs uh, today, 18 packs next Friday. Uh, opened one of these on the channel not too long ago, and it was very successful. If you missed my PSA reveal video from yesterday, definitely check that out. Lots of good results. Pulled both these cards from the same box. Beam Team, Mint 9, and Member's Choice Rookie, uh, Gem Mint 10. We also had a, a base rookie that graded... Uh, Mint 9, that's not as valuable, the 9 and that, but the, the Beam Team was a monster hit, and to get a 9 on this is great. This is like, I checked some recent auctions, it's about a $900 or so card now, and this is, you know, over 100 bucks, maybe 150 or somewhere in that range. But to get over a 1000 bucks in graded cards from one old hobby box is not too shabby. So... We're going to press our luck and, and go one more time, and we'll see what we can get out of this one. Maybe we'll pull a, an MJ Beam Team this time. So I think there's, there's 21 Beam Team cards in the insert set, and we got two in the last box. We got the Shaq and the Kevin Johnson. Uh, so obviously Kevin Johnson, not a huge hit, but the Shaq was a monster. So really the only other one that would be great to hit out of this box besides the Shaq would be an MJ. So maybe we got the Shaq last time, maybe we'll get the MJ this time. But we'll never know until we open it up and find out. So here we go. Pack number one. Let's hope we get some cards in very good condition, good enough to send to a future PSA sub. And oh, they're really they're not really stuck together at all, which is great. Here's your base card, front and back, Charles Smith. It's funny, they put, they would are supposed to put the rookie cards, the Topps rookie card, but since Topps didn't make cards for so long, from like the early 80s until uh, the 92-93 set, they have the 92-93 Topps card on a lot of these guys. So here's our first rookie, Todd Day. Uh, maybe we'll get some more good rookies in good shape. Hakeem. I'm actually going to take all the, any kind of superstar card. Guys like Hakeem, Bird, Magic. Uh, I'm going to put those to the side. And potentially, you know, if, if they look good, even base cards of uh, certain Hall of Famers. Mark Jackson still calling the NBA Finals games right now. Could potentially get a uh, good card graded by a Hall of Famer if we get something in good condition. These look pretty good at first glance. Again, there's a lot of cards to go through, so I'm not going to spend a lot of time uh, looking at condition of all these cards. Sean Green, Chris Mull, the member's choice. So you can see the member's choice have a little bit of a shine to the foil at the bottom as opposed to just the flat gold foil of the base cards. So we'll put these members choice and Hall of Famer cards aside. We'll put rookies in the middle and all the rest of the base cards as a checklist. You know what? I should even look at the checklist. Maybe if I get a checklist with uh, with Shaq on the checklist, maybe that card will be worth something. All right, pack one down. Let's go a little faster now through the rest of them. We got 18 packs to go in video number one. Every pack comes with this Stadium Club membership card, which I'm sure is long since expired. And we might not separate all the rookies. It might take too long. Clarence Weatherspoon, draft pick. Philly made a lot of bad draft picks back then, picking guys like Clarence Weatherspoon, Sean Bradley. Early 90s was not a good time for... Sixers draft picks up until Iverson. That's when they broke their curse. So 
Another Chris Mullen member's choice, same one we got in the first pack. Matt Geiger, <laughs> a lot of the same guys uh, in, in the first two packs. So the cool thing about this is, you know, as I showed you the PSA reveal, there's multiple Shaq cards. There's the base rookie and then there's the member's choice. So a lot of chances for good stuff. Hey, Alonzo Morning, member's choice. That's a PC hit. Although I already have a bunch of those that I opened in the, uh, in the first box. Tom Gugliata. Dale Davis. Nothing great in this pack outside of that morning. Lots of flipping. Okay. It's pack number three. Let's go to pack number four. So like I said, we're hoping for two more beam teams. I don't know what the exact odds were. They didn't put the odds on the box. I thought it was one beam team per box, but like I said, we got two in the last box last time we did this. So maybe we'll get two again in this box. And hopefully we hit a big one. There's Todd Day again, Charles Smith again. <laughs> Already getting the same guys, Tim Hardaway. The Admiral, David Robinson. So again, I'll put I'll put Hall of Famers in their own stack. And maybe we'll get lucky with condition on these and have have some stuff I can send in. I'll do a big uh, bulk sub at some point. With older cards like this, it's uh a lot cheaper uh, to do a, a bulk sub. It's going to take a lot longer to get these cards back, but I think any anything prior to 2017, which obviously this is way before 2017, it's still only 10 bucks a card to do a bulk sub with PSA uh, through the uh, group submissions that I use. Oh, that Shaq was hiding back there. <laughs> I almost missed it. Shaquille O'Neal, member's choice. I like it. I hope I didn't uh, damage it by pulling it apart from the card in front of it. But we got Shaq number one down. And look, a couple of these are stuck together. Reggie Lewis. And every card is flipped upside down. So there's no, the only base Michael Jordan cards we can get out of here is gonna be the member's choice. So the regular Jordan base card from this set, which has an awesome photo of him dunking over Patrick Ewing. Unfortunately, that's only in series one. So we won't be able to pull that base Jordan out of a series two box. Maybe I'll do a series one box at some point. Those are still pretty cheap. Um, and you know, if, if you get uh, a PSA 10 MJ base card, that's like probably more than double the price you'll pay for an entire box. So kind of low risk, uh, low risk, medium reward, I guess. The Kembe. Hey, Shaq number two, member's choice. The good thing now that I have a PSA 10 member's choice, I can compare the ones that I am pulling now. And if they look, if they look the same as that PSA 10, I can use that as a guide to see which ones I should submit for grading and which ones are, I'm probably better off not, not submitting. But again, if I'm doing a bulk sub, even a PSA 9 is not huge money, but better than nothing. Better than a raw card for sure. And there's the base, Shaq Rookie. So this is Shaquille number three in the first, probably 25% of this box. So hopefully that all these Shaqs, we keep up our Shaq luck and we can pull another Shaq beam team. That would just be monstrous. Dominique, member's choice. I'll put Neek in our hit stack and I'll put, you know what, we'll just do two stacks. We'll do hits and then 
all the base and, and kind of not so good rookies will just go in the big. I wonder why they didn't put 92 draft pick over there like they did on a lot of the other rookies for that Christian Leitner. That seems kind of strange. All right, so pretty good start so far with a bunch of Shaq cards. Here's the same Chris Mullen member's choice again. This is the third one of this we've gotten already. Collation, not great now, not great then. A lot of times you're getting the same cards over and over. Hakeem Olajuwon. Yeah, I feel like this is a lot of the same guys as the first pack. There's Mark Jackson again, Tom Tolbert. Chuck Person. Man, he was Chuck Person was born in the wrong era. I feel like he'd be much more successful if he played now, the way he shot threes. Alfonso Ellis, I think that's a rookie card. Hubert Davis and Chris Mullen member's choice for the third for the third time. All right, we are eight packs in. I'm looking for that beam team. Gerald Wilkins. Walt Williams, this is a rookie car that's got the 92 draft pick logo on there. Keith Askins, Byron Houston, Larry Nance, father of Larry Nance Jr., Reggie Miller, Hall of Famer. Hey, there's our Zoe member's choice again, PC hit. Donald Royal. And I think when we did this box a few months ago, we pulled both the beam teams out of the second half of the box. We didn't get any in the first half. So let's see if, uh, if that happens again. I'll gladly wait to pull the beam teams until the second half if it's gonna be someone like Shaq or MJ. Malik Seeley, Dwayne Cooper, rookie, Mark Bryant. X-Man, Xavier McDaniel. Billy Owens, he kind of became a bust. Jaron Jackson, father of Jaron Jackson Jr. So we got Larry Nance Sr. and Jaron Jackson Sr. so far. Doherty, David Wingate, Baby Jordan, Harold Miner. Man, what a curse to put on that guy, calling him Baby Jordan. Ewing, I like this card. This is Shadow MJ card. Greg Grant with Jordan in the background. Those are always kind of cool shadow cards. Manute Bull, father of Bull Bull, lots of, lots of dads with uh, young players in the league right now. All right, I think this is pack number 12. So what did I say? We'll get to 18 today and finish the rest, finish the other 18. Oh, beam team, beam team. Okay, come on. Let's just look at it right now. Ah, uh, Chris Mullen. Not the best one to get. All 
All right, so there's our there's our one beam team. Let's uh, let's hope we can get one more before this box is over. Yeah, that card definitely didn't look like a PSA 10, and honestly, I think even a Chris Mullen in a PSA 10 is probably one of the least valuable beam teams we could pull out of here. So, no Monster Shack beam team like last time unless we can get one more. I think the, so the pack that doesn't have this membership form, hey, morning member choice number three. The, the pack that doesn't have that uh, Stadium Club membership card is the pack that has the beam team. Sir Charles Barkley. We thought about this back then like we do now with cards where we say, hey, uh, like LeBron, Prism, Lakers rookie card. This is uh, <laughs> Charles Barkley, Suns rookie card. That definitely just became a thing now. Not sure how much that's going to hold up long term, but it definitely was not a, was not a thing back then. Dumars, Mitch Richmond. Haven't pulled the uh, MJ Members Choice card yet. I assume we're going to be getting that at some point. I think I pulled at least a couple of them out of the last box. But unfortunately, the one I pulled was not, the couple that I pulled were not in great shape. Robert Ori, big shot, Rob. Christian Leitner, member's choice. Don McLean, Larry Johnson. Man, too bad Larry Johnson's career was cut short by injuries. That guy had a lot of, a lot of potential, a lot of promise. Didn't quite turn out the way a lot of people had hoped. All right, <laughs> Shaquille O'Neal, member's choice number three. Let's hope one of these can get can get a PSA ten again. I'm sure I'll be doing another bulk sub with all these all these shacks we're pulling. Okay, I think that was 16, so we'll do two more. Get us to 18. We're almost at 20 minutes in this video, just going through half the box. So many cards to leaf through. Uh, so we'll definitely split this up into two pieces, and we'll do part two of the video next Friday. This is pack number 17. Another Dominique. I think we pulled like four of those. Leitner again. All right, we'll do one more pack. Pack number 18, then we'll get back to part two next week. So pulled one beam team so far. Hopefully there's another beam team hiding in here. And hopefully it's either a Shaq or an MJ. See if we can get lucky again like we did in that first box. Regular Dominique card. Sticking with our Hall of Famers. And Patrick Ewing member's choice. Okay, so that's the first half of this box. Let's quickly go through our hit stack. Um, so again, these aren't not really hits. I'll have to look and see if any of these are worth grading. If they are, they might be worth something, but if not, 
uh, that are not worth too much raw. But we got Shaq members choice number one. The MJ Shadow card. What is our other Shaq cards? We got the base Shaq rookie. Members choice number two. And members choice number three. So we got four Shaqs um, out of just the first half of the box. And the beam team we got, unfortunately, was Chris Mullen. So not a monster hit there on the beam team. But that's okay. Uh, hopefully there's one more beam team hiding in the rest of the box. And we already got four Shaqs. So uh, I'd be surprised if we get any more Shaqs in the second half of the box. But you never know. Um, but thanks for watching this video, guys. Uh, stay tuned for next week, and we'll finish the box. Uh, so I'll see you then.